what I've done, what I've been working on is a bidet. Uh, you know, where you wash your ass for my mother, which is 85, and she's on diapers. And a lot of times, if you, if you crap in your diaper, um, you can't just take a diaper off and go sit on your toilet seat and take a crap and wipe your butt and it'd be clean. You really need to take a shower, okay? Because once you crap in a diaper, it, it puts it everywhere. So I've been working on a shower bidet, which there are shower chairs for elderly and there are toilet chairs for elderly. So I've combined the two. I've combined a shower chair and a toilet chair, a bedside toilet chair for the elderly or handicapped. Not only the elderly, just handicapped people can use it too. And uh, I hooked a shower wand to it. Let me show you what well, I've done. Let me show you the prototypes that I came up with that didn't work and then I'll, I'll show you what I ended up with. Okay. There's a handheld bidet underneath there. <laughs> Hooked to a PVC pipe that's mounted to the front. Okay. And I did not put glue in here. I guess I hit the wrong button. I, did, I didn't put glue in there, right there. So that allows this to be adjustable. You know, you can raise it up and down to uh, hit, the, hit the right spot. If you need to hit the sweet spot, if it's not hit the sweet spot now, all we gotta do is push it down and push it up to uh, adjust it. And it also goes left and right. If you wanna adjust it left and right, you can. But this comes out. This whole thing right here comes out of there. Okay, because look, all that is is a shower wand, a shower handle, just like that. See there? It's a shower wand that I've hooked into a diverter. There's my diverter. And there's my splitter. I've put a splitter on my diverter. So this handle controls the bidet. That handle controls the shower. The diverter actually controls both of this and that. So now when my elderly mother gets in here to wash her ass, this would be perfectly able to spray in the right spot. All she has to do is hit that yellow handle and it will activate psh, spray. Turn it off, turn it off. Continue taking a shower, do what you gotta do, and then I'll bleach the floor. I've been working on this problem for a while, trying to figure out how to clean her, uh, you know, when we have problems. And sometimes we have more problems than others. Just depends on the situation. But I think I've got it figured out now to where um, <laughs> we, 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 we've got it figured out now how to clean and get her good and clean because it's very important to get her good and clean. Um, we have a handheld bidet like that in the shower in her bathroom. Okay, so at the toilet, when she actually uses the toilet, she can reach around there with one of those things and spray her behind. I've got one on my toilet. And uh, I mean, when you when you get old or you're handicapped or you get big, like I'm big, I can't reach my booty hole. It's, you know, kind of, you might laugh at me or whatever, but that's okay. Um, I hope you never get in this situation that we are with, uh, you know, being elderly and, and, and over obese and handicapped and other things. It's just, you know, you're, it, some things get hard to do and you have to try to figure out other ways to do them. So I'm gonna, I put a couple pictures in, I don't know if you've seen them, but I had a prototype. It was way too close and when I sat down, it poked me in the butt. It just, it's like I was sitting right on it. So I had to do something different and the PVC worked well. I'm just gonna add the pictures to the end of the first prototype and uh, it didn't work because it was way too close to the booty hole. When you sat down, it was actually touching and that's no good. So I'll show you the pictures later of the PVC and what it ended up being at the end. Get it at the end? Ha <laughs> ha!